For Tina, hope triumphed over hate. Faith won over fear, and ambition eclipsed adversity. In the words of the late Maya Angelou, you may shoot me with your words, you may cut me with your eyes, you may kill me with your hatefulness, but still, like air, I'll rise. And Tina rose. Tina, welcome on your own to the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. <laughs> You know the saying, behind every great man, there's a woman. What's behind the great woman, Tina Turner? <laughs> Talent. <laughs> I started with Ike in 1960. Ike was an insecure man and very possessive. Really thinking about it, it was a form of imprisonment. I realized that Ike and I could not work together for all time. And then we met Phil Spector. You would have thought he was going to produce Ike. I guess he knew the one to go to. When I was a little girl, I had a dragon. You're like a bird that gets out of a cage. It was a freedom to do something different. And it gets in every way. And it gets deeper. He was taking my range. He was doing everything with my voice. I was finding out things about myself. A great singer knows how to emote and put every memory and every feeling into those words. And Tina made every song that she sang her song. I was asked to do Tommy. And I found out what I knew because I was on my own. And that really went a long way for me. <laughs> Is it all right for me to ask you if you and Ike are together or separated or, or divorced or... Separated and divorced. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of people felt that Tina Turner could not do a show without Ike. She had that really rough time, and I loved her, and so I wanted her to be on my show. I always took from my experiences to do what I needed to do. I started to play hotel circles in Las Vegas and some television shows. I realized that it was management that I was missing. That's why I wasn't going anywhere. I'd be in Las Vegas all my life. You know when you meet an artist if they have that charisma, and she was also incredibly determined. Then we started working to get a record deal. Nobody would touch Tina Turner. She wanted to be with the Rock Boys. Something started to turn inside of me, I felt. I've been running around singing forever. How can I feel stadiums? I wanted it. I wanted to do what Jagger and all of the other guys at the time was doing. Roger said to me, you want to do that? You got to make some records. Let's try it. Don't forget to jump in. That one. That one. Ah, oh, it's wonderful that one is. It's so, so misty. You must understand the touch of your hand makes my folks react. First song I got for this album was What's Love Gotta Do With It. It was so different. It was one of those songs that you get maybe once a decade. It's physical. And the record of the year is Only What's Love Gotta Do With It? You must try to ignore that it means more than that. Oh. What's love got to do? What's got to do with it? She's incredible. 
to just be reaching her peak at 50. It's not only inspiring to us women, but it changes the rules in the playbook. Well, I think it's all so right. We don't need to fight. A black woman owning that stage all by herself. That's the dream right there. Represent your case. Yes, I know. You keep telling me that you love me. And I really do want to believe. A jean jacket and a leather dress, big hair. That was me becoming what I always wanted. I became a rock and roll star. Legend was that Tina Turner was the woman who taught Mick Jagger how to dance. No, it was an exchange. His songs actually inspired me, and so my steps inspired him, so that those sort of came together. True. Yeah, I used, you know? well, I used to watch her, uh, the back, her back, you know, get this back. <laughs> really was an innovator of having powerful women on stage going absolutely crazy. No one had ever seen anything like that. The definition of insanity is to get on stage with Tina Turner. You're not going to break her. You're not going to do anything to her. I don't think there's going to ever be a woman that can touch her. She's the epitome of never giving up on yourself and on your story and what you want to do in your life. Everything that she had been through and to still be here and to have a metamorphosis just goes to show that Tina Turner is undeniable. My wish was to arrive here, where I am today. It's a happiness that I never knew that that's what happiness was. So my legacy is a person that strived for wanting it better and got it. Hi, everybody. It was really special when I heard that the Hall of Fame was giving me a trophy. If they're still giving me awards at 81, I must have done something right. Yeah, this is mine. Only, I don't care if you know. <laughs> I'm very happy to have this and to have achieved this Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. It's great. Thank you. Here to pay tribute to the Rock and Roll Hall of Famer Tina Turner, Christina Aguilera, <laughs> Mickey Guyton, and to start it off, her and Keith Urban.
touch of your hand makes my pulse react That it's only the thrill Boy meeting girl of a sense of track It's physical hey. Only logical You must try to ignore that it means When I was a little girl